When you receive your RON 886 encoder, you're going to notice that it's going to be completely protected in hard styrofoam packaging. On the front of the box, you'll see the laser calibration report. And the, the RON 800 series has a guaranteed accuracy of plus or minus one arc second. Obviously this one came in very well. It was 0.16 arc seconds of repeatable accuracy through the entire 360 degree rotation of this encoder. Every Heidenhain angle encoder will come with a laser calibration report as, so, as well as many of their linear encoders as well. Additionally, you'll have the uh, mounting instructions coming in different languages and as you see, as you open this up, it'll talk about um, the tools to use, tools not to use, the different types of connectors, the drawing of it for the dimensional purposes, mounting instructions with tolerances, and it creates a 1 volt peak to peak signal and various connectors. Now many people buy the RON 886 to replace older Heidenhain encoders that have been underneath a rotary table for many years. The good thing about Heidenhain is they seem to last a very very long time. If a customer already has a RON 800 series with 11 microamp running through the entire system, a lot of times they'll opt to purchase this signal adapter. It's very simple. On the end of it, you'll see that it receives the 1 volt peak to peak signal, plugs in, and then the output is going to be the older 11 microamp signal. Then you can continue to use your older EXE interpolation boxes or your existing 9 conductor cable. So those are the two documents that come with the RON 886. You can also order it as a RON 786. That will give you an accuracy guarantee of plus or minus 2 arc second. Now this is an incremental angle encoder. You can also order it as absolute. That would be called the RPN 886 and that will give you the absolute position as well. When you open it up you're going to see there the mounting holes but also these milled out drainage channels, that's for any contaminants that may uh, pool up under the table. You want to make sure that you keep this encoder in a protected area. If there are any contaminants that do accumulate, these will drain away from the bearing, the housing. Also on the back side you'll notice they have similar drain channels. Again you've got the seal right there. This is a 60 millimeter through hole and this particular encoder RON 8A6 was ordered as a standard 36,000 line count 1 volt peak to peak. There's the ID number and then there's the serial number. Many people use these underneath rotary tables for high accuracy position of their table and again this is a RON 886.